Hi class, my name's Todd Bradley. I'm a part-time photographer and I belong to a photography group called Snow Creek Collaborative. Two years ago, we changed the way that we do our holiday photo exchange and turned it more into a cookie party type of idea where we walk out with a full portfolio of images from everybody that wanted to participate. And I would love to share that with you right now. I just picked up mine the other day. So let me share my screen here. Start this. I'm just going to walk you through the images as I put them together in a group. Here we have a woman gazing out into the field, kind of in wonder as we start our journey, um, which brings us to Brazil in the 70s, and then to Egypt to a vendor on the Nile who had fallen asleep. <laughs> um, then Louise Russell asks the question, what do people do to the environment? As she shows the relationship between the Kumeyaay Indian land and the men that took that land and how they're treating it today. And here we have a beautiful painted desert landscape. That's a nice pause. And this shows a marshland from the East Coast. And it is um, part of a portfolio that shows marshes from both coasts. Wayne Swanson is talking about the beetles that are destroying the Canary Island ponds in San Diego. This is my image, which talks about the relationship between native and non-native plants and how non-native plants are decimating the local um, agriculture here. And we have a beautiful um, cherry tree from the Japanese Friendship Garden from Will Gibson. And Tom showing us a very um, cold looking landscape, beautiful trees there. Here's another nice pause, the Japanese vase, very Zen like from Jody Holden. Chris Moore examines the trash that's left behind on our beaches. And here we have kind of a fantasy landscape of a woman maybe turning her back on the earth. Don't know. Robert Treat did a gorgeous, delicate cyanotype that kind of looks like a lost civilization um, or maybe a new civilization. Brandy Sebastian takes on geometric forms in an abstract. Marie Quiche also takes on um, an abstract design from buildings and Brian Van Wetterling. Um, to some light painting and kind of makes us wonder what does the future of the world hold? Thank you very much for looking at, at that and let me know what you think. Thank you.